it's not easy. We know uh, we have in the war context uh, uh, incredible icons in art history like uh, Los Fusilamientos by Goya or Guernica by, by Picasso. But uh, nowadays, I think the war is mm, the idea of war is, is, is more, more complex. Mm, we fight uh, against the global warning, uh, we fight against um, consumerism, against high tech control, also against extreme political positions. So I think the, the art is, is, is necessary in this, in, in this case because the art uh, can provoke more, maybe more emotional answers. So uh, it's mm, something like it's, it's, it's more than a cold data. Art moves to understanding further than only information. So I think right now uh, the, the artist is a um, very crucial person who can provoke and uh, who, uh, who can um, show us how is our society and probably the art doesn't give us a solution but this is a way to provoke a movement through. So in this case, I think in this this movie, trying to uh, to become aware against global warming, maybe it's one of them. I think, but I don't know how important is art, but I know that really is absolutely necessary. The time, the time is very important in all kind of different situation in, in art. Time in the movie, time of art, time of travel as well. And we can distinguish, we can find uh, three different levels of the time. No? In the case of the travel, it's uh, before to go, preparing all kind of things and taking information of the in the, the place. This is for first time, first kind of times. There is another second one is uh, when you are in the place, uh, deeply living in the real experience of travel, trying to take everything off. You can see and you can feel. And the third is uh, after the trip, when you come back at home, uh, how everything you, you, you are lived how we can change your thoughts, no? how this past experience can transform your real and nowadays way to think. This is different levels, but in real, in re, really the, the art, you know, the artists are intellectual constructions. In this way, uh, I think every time we are in in a real process, uh, we are in progress, and we are every time removing, we are recreating. Um, the time is not a line; it's like a scribble, something more mixed, strained, and complex. But I think we can say that the time is the real theme of art, also in this movie. This is a very interesting question. So the, the multidisciplinary in art, mm, we know that the, the cinema is not only a, a visual language. We can use sound, we can use uh, different uh, ways of message. So here in the, in the past country, uh, we have a 
very old tradition about the oral poetry. It's a, also, also the, the oral tradition. Uh, we said the, this is versolarismo. So, Xavi Paya, the, the person who is speaking with the bo uh, bo of, of voice in the, in the movie, is one of the best uh, versolarists in the past country and then of the world. No? So, um, for us, uh, this to introduce this kind of uh, old tradition with a very new point of view is very interesting for us in the in the movie. Uh, you know, the contemporary attitude is absolutely fragmentary. It's a very short fragmentary experience of life. And then also I think uh, the nowadays movie have to take this kind of attitude to mix, to add, to is like a real puzzle. Um, so I think it's very, very interesting to try to mix different uh, ways and through that uh, to understand how we can learn from the from the others, no? try to to listen to others, uh, try to to improve, missing, mm, adding the dif different uh, voice, different message, different tools, different poetries. So I think the mix can be find anyway and you feel in and we try that. Thank you.